What's going on, guys? So, I kept talking about it. Now we're going to do it. For some people, these aren't that much money, so it's not a big deal. But to me, it doesn't feel like a $40, $50, $50 box. That's how much I paid for it. Uh, these feel like they're already worth a couple hundred bucks. I've heard there's a lot of hype about these. I've heard the pull rate's really good. So I'm going to carefully open this so that way I can at least put the plastic sleeve back over it when I'm done. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to open all the packs, but I'm just very curious to see the pull rate in, in these. So here we go. I am going to cut this from the... Let's see. Cut this from the bottom. That way it's less noticeable. I did scratch it, but see that it doesn't you don't have to destroy it. Okay. Get this guy off. This was definitely a nice tight seal. Okay. First impressions, super nice box. I really like this. All right, so I've never opened an ETB before actually. Okay, so this cover slides off. It's got a nice little player's guide booklet. Train on, okay. This guy over here. This just pops off. A lot of money into the packaging of this thing. That's so cool. Okay, so we've got dice, looks like rules, counters. I love it. That's, that's awesome. And the dice look like they are counter dice as well. We've got in this side, looks like it's just sleeves. I like that separator, but I want to make sure, um, what the heck, these are so, what, okay, so there's, okay, I don't, I don't know what Greninja is, is worth, but I, I didn't know there was even a hollow card, so y'all can see this, Greninja, not sure what this guy is worth. We got some we got some sleeves there. I see we got some sleeves. Um, let's see, I just want to read this. One special foil card featuring Greninja. So I, I just want to check my other ETB and, and look if that is the same thing. Greninja. Okay. So these Greninja are going to be um, overproduced and probably not that uh, valuable for that reason. Um, we're going to slip him right back in there because that's where he originally was. I'm more interested in these packs. Okay, got these packs. Wait a minute, what's going on here? Oh, you get you get the other booster packs. Okay, yeah, no. How how do you how do you lose how do you lose money on this? I thought it was just the celebrations packs. Okay, now I'm getting excited, guys. We got a lot of stuff going on here, man. It just feels so cool to to feel all these all these packs. Um, Diana, would you uh, get the scale for me so I can weigh these packs out and just see if there's any way I can tell what's heavier than what? Uh, there are only four cards, so so Diana, my lovely wife, is going to go grab the scale so I can see if I can weigh any of these out. Pretty sweet. Oh, we got a, we got a, so you get 10 four-card booster packs, so you get 40 celebrations cards, 
Thank you. We get one special foil card, sleeves, energy cards, six damage counters, five additional TCG packs. Okay, so we don't know what the additional packs would be, but in this case, Vivid Voltage and Chilling Rain are those packs. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take these chilling rain packs and I'm gonna I'm gonna scale these out and see which is the heavy one and I'm gonna open that one and I'm gonna leave the rest of these alone because I wasn't even interested in opening these. But I think it's cool that I have some packs that don't have the sleeves and I kind of for that reason don't wanna open them because they're probably in the best condition like this. Man, that makes me like this ETB so much more. Okay. Okay, first pack weighs in at 22 grams. Second pack weighs in at 22.1. Third pack weighs in at 21.9. Fourth pack weighs in at 21.4. That is the vivid voltage. So different pack could just be different. We get 22, was this one 22? And this one was 22.1. So we got 22.1 and was this 22.4? 22.4. Those are our heavies. So we're gonna, uh, I wanna keep the Chilling Rain pack because it's got the Zapdos. Um, you know what, we'll open a lighter pack. Hold on. 22.0. Hey, 22 is good. That's a good number. Let's, let's go with 22. Let's see how this works out. You know, I haven't opened any of the new packs, so this is the first new pack I'm gonna open. Chilling Rain. This is like, uh, nostalgic. How do people even open these? I can't get this open. Okay, so I'll, I'll try it from this side. Oh my gosh. You almost have to... Man, you really gotta tear into this guy. Okay, jeez. Okay, well... It's probably a good thing. It's it's hard to it'll it, it should be hard to replicate this seal process when it's hard like that to get open. Okay, these guys are airtight. Okay, we're gonna save that uh, pack art. Leave that pack art in there. Actually, I'll put that pack art out. Um, okay, so I'm not gonna do the whole card trick thing. I'm gonna get rid of our online card there. Just gonna shuffle them around. So we got, still love this card. I haven't seen any of these new arts. We got Farfetch'd. Okay. Sneasel, which still a really cool looking card. Uh, rapid Strike Sneasel. I don't like the, the, the words on the top. I'm already regretting opening it. We've got uh, Deerling. Wow, how original Pokemon. We got Gallet. Pretty awful. We got Diglett. At least it's an original Pokemon. We like our Diglett. Uh, it says Rapid Strike on it. I'm just not a fan of that. Flannery. Don't care about that. Gaitha, don't care about her. Sorry, Gaitha. Uh, Curlia, at least this is a Sapphire Pokemon, so I'm, I'm kind of okay with that. Uh, Fire Energy. Whoa! Nice! We got a Calyrex VMAX. I was not expecting that. That's really nice. I'm not, I'm not sure what this card is worth. I'm going to have to go figure that out. 
I know right now they have a lot of hollows, so not to get too excited. Uh, but it is not a V, it is a V Max. Um, until I can figure out what that's worth. Uh, oh, that is actually, it must be worth something because it is the Pokemon on the front of this. Am I seeing that right? I'm seeing that right. Yes, this is the Pokemon that is the pack art. I'm pretty sure we got a freaking winner here, which is funny because um, that was one of the lighter packs. My wife was showing me some information that shows that the lighter packs are having uh, better pull rates. I want to get a good sleeve here. Okay, and I'm going to set this guy in here until I figure out what it's worth. My first Pokemon pull, and it was the actual pack art. Go figure. Who would have thought? Okay, we got that Calyrex in there now. I'm gonna leave that guy out. Um, the last was a hollow, reverse hollow deerling, which is still cool. I still got another, I got two hollows in that pack. I really can't complain. I'm just gonna put these cards, um, including the hollow. I may just gift this to somebody when I'm selling cards. Um, it still is a holographic. Um, I'll put all that back together and I'll put it in this pack and I'll just probably gift it. Um, also, I like how it keeps the pack weight the same. And in 20 years, just just having an original pack like this, it's just nice. It's cool. Okay. Let's get to the good stuff. So, our celebrations. Let's weigh these guys out. Okay. We got 9.8. Might not even matter. 9.9, .9. it really might not even matter. <clears throat> 9.7, okay. We got three different, 9.7, got some lighter ones over here. Okay, Callie, stop. Okay, you gonna help me open some packs. 9.6, so 9.6. What was this top one? Nine. 9.9, 9. okay. Okay, we got 9.7. Oh, keeps falling. 9.7. We got a lot that are in the same area. I've heard nothing but good things about this. Callie says she's heard nothing but good things about this. 9.6. So we got a lot of stuff down there. We only got two packs that were on the heavy side from what I can see, 9.7, 9.6. Okay, so I'm gonna start. What do you wanna do, Callie? Which one would you pick? She's like, that one. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go with this heaviest one that we've seen. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna take her. All right, I'm gonna open this from the bottom, actually. Hopefully it opens uh, more easily than that one did. Okay, we got that seal opened. Okay, we are open. Okay. Ah, I tore it, I didn't wanna tear it. Okay, so What's crazy is I thought I was going to open this and get something super like basic. Already now I'm confident that Walmart is a straight place to buy sealed stuff. I was a little bit worried, but I don't know what this guy's worth. But the fact that he was on the front of the pack art says a lot. Those are usually the rarest cards. I would, this would be sick if this was at least a hundred bucks um, for a $50. So much, so many. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, shiznit. Oh, shiznit. Did not hear that. We got a ho -o. Beautiful. That art is beautiful. I'm already happy with this pack. No wonder everyone's talking about this. Okay. My wife is making a face like there's something really shiny in there. All right, let's get this ho -o put away. 
No, you a ho ho. Ho ho. Ho ho. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's really, it's a pretty card. Just so you guys can see all the way up here. Beautiful art on him. You almost can't even see the, the 25 Pikachu. And that's holographic too, which is kind of neat. Oh, Callie, relax. Um, not going to worry about top loaders. Actually, I'm going to put it in a top loader. That's what I'm going to do. So it's the right thing to do. And with how long the video is, being 15 minutes now, we might have to... Oh, it does not want to go in the top loader. Okay. We're just going to leave that out. We might have to cut this short because we haven't even revealed these other cards. Okay. What's this next card? Oh, get out of town. Seriously? Lugia? Oh my gosh. Another legendary bird. I can't right now. I can't with this pack. This is too good. This is too good. The artwork on this is, is phenomenal. <laughs> Way to make, way to make the old collectors, way to make the old fanboys happy. You threw in an oldie with a new artwork. That's outstanding, <laughs> outstanding. I am so happy I opened this box right now. Uh, I'm so happy I opened this box. We got two legendary birds. I got a VMAX. I'm freaking out. Okay, okay. What are we getting? Oh, nice. We got a Pikachu. We got a really, really big Pikachu. <laughs> this is the VMAX Pikachu. I don't know what he's worth, but beautiful. This card is beautiful. Wow. Oh, it's the surfing Pikachu VMAX. This is a popular one. I know that for a fact. People are going after the surfing VMAX Pikachu. So I'm gonna sleeve him up. <laughs> yeah, every everything in these, there are gonna be a lot of PSA tens in here. There are going to be, and this evolves from a Dynamax. Man, there are going to be a lot, a lot, a lot. Let's just put it that way. Okay, we'll put this over here for our pulls. We got one more, we got one more, and I can't tell what he is. What is this? Beautiful, but what is it? Cosmoem. Cosmoem, star protector. Oh, kind of cute. Seems like something my wife would like. It's a little girl sleeping next to her Cosmoem, I guess. Don't really, see these are the cards that like, I didn't get this pack for. Uh, anyways, Cosmo, it's a hollow card. It deserves to go on a sleeve. So it can maintain that high PSA grading. Okay. We're gonna open one more pack because that's all we got time for. Um, wait a minute. Oh yeah, that's just the, that's the E card. Okay. That's all we have time for. Okay, but this was another one of the heavies. Okay, I'm gonna open this guy from the bottom. I'm having so much fun. I'm having so much fun. Are you sure you don't wanna open up a pack? You wanna come over here, open up a pack? Maybe. Guys, you know she should come over here and open up a pack, right? You should definitely come over here and open up a pack. You could be my lucky charm. You never know. You are my lucky charm. So, I'm sorry guys. That's... Okay. <laughs> Alright. Carefully, carefully pull this out. I saw a little bit of something, but I don't know anything about the cars these days. So, no big deal there. Okay. Oh, no, I showed you guys some. Oh, I'm not good at this. Okay. Okay. Boom. Oh, Rocket Zapdos. I want this so bad. 
I want the vintage Rocket Zapdos so bad. And the fact that I pulled this, when right now this is a $200 card used, is fantastic. Winner, winner, chicken. Oh, the artwork is beautiful. You can't even see it that well. On there, on there, it doesn't look as crazy as it actually is. I like this speckle that they did. Um, this, oh, wow, this has a whole, it has a whole embedded, it's like fingerprint pattern, kind of. It's kind of wild. That is definitely, that is definitely PSA 10 worthy. I love that it's got the OG stuff. Okay, all right, next card. We're going in 20 minutes here. Boom! I know this guy, I don't know his name, but I know it's like from Pearl or something. It's one of the newer games. Dialga, another legendary. We pulled another legendary. This is why everyone is talking about these ETBs. These are gonna be hot on the market. You can, you can bet your bottom dollar that everyone's gonna be starting bidding wars for these. Look at all these beautiful cars with beautiful art. That's just phenomenal. Okay. I don't have my sleeves in here and I don't want to wake up the baby. So I'm going to leave Dialga against here, even though that's, it could be a crime. I don't know how much that card is worth. Maybe it should be going in a sleeve immediately. Um, but yeah, we're not going to wake up the baby. So let's just keep going and we'll be careful. We'll be careful. Okay. What did we get? Did we get Mew? Did we get Mew? We got Mew. We got Mew. Mew looks really, really good. This art is beautiful. Beautiful. Very, very happy with this right now. Very happy with this right now. I, I might start some bidding wars on eBay for like 10, 10 boxes. I, I'm really, I'm really liking these. This is a good long-term sit. Oh, Cosmo, um, we don't care about you. Cosmo, um, you're lame. Hey, get over here. Open a pack. Oh, my wife is gonna come now and take over. I will roll next to her. I'll be right by her side if you need help opening up that pack. Do I grab these ones or these ones? Uh, this guy right here. So you wanna open I want to open the bottom here mm -hmm. and kind of peel it so it opens up and then just gently open the bottom there. No, guys, these are not vintage base set packs. So she probably doesn't need to worry about how she's opening it. But it's just like the respect of the game and the cards and the collectability and so forth. Also, again, this is the first time she's been on video with me, but this is my lovely wife, Diana. Hi. Diana, this is YouTube. <laughs> I cannot open this. You're getting it. You're getting it. Be gentle. Are we opening from the front? Be, no, you don't want to tear it. Oops. You just want to have it like spread like that. There you go. You got the nails. Sorry, guys. Bear with me. I know. She's. We're struggling here. Okay. Okay. So now that the pack has been torn to shreds. Hey. Sure no, 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 you didn't want to open it from the back like that. It's all yeah. good. It's all good. It's all good. I've never opened one of these. It's okay. So we don't want to see what it is. We don't want them to see what it is. This doesn't matter, but we need to keep it like this to them. So you can shuffle the cards if you want. Keep them down, don't look at them. You can't know either. Point them to the camera, just like I did, over there. And then uh, show, them, show them what you got. Okay, so that looks like some kind of legendary uh, Xerneas. Xerneas, sorry guys, I'm these newer Pokemon. So we're gonna put him down. Not too worried about him. Just gonna be careful. What else did we get? Come on, come on, come on. Be something cool. Okay, we got another ho. -Oh. We got another ho. -Oh. So I can sell a ho. -Oh. We got another ho. -Oh. 
I, I wish I had a sleeve. No, this is a dope card. I should have a sleeve for it. Okay, we got a full art Professor Oak, it looks like. Mm -hmm. Professor's Research, okay. It's, it's, very, little, it's very shiny. Get you at the bottom. So cute. Okay, come on. This is for the money. This is for the money. This is for the money. What is it? I can't see what it is. That is a Vettel. It's it's like Ye Vettel. That's a legendary bird or something. I tried it. That's the the newer series. <laughs> Me too. Cry of destruction. <laughs> Cry of destruction. You want to open up another one? Sure. Let's go. Let's go for gold. Let's go for gold. Do you want to go for the lower ones? Yeah. And just see. Can you open it? Yeah. Okay, so we get that little, we get that little hole. And then we grab that, and then we just, in this uh, way, and we keep the seal, we keep the seal. We don't want to bend the cards for sure, but we keep the seal that way. The pack is still like in really good shape. Not that we need it to be in good shape, but I mean, you never know. Celebrations <laughs> packs, just these packs in 30 years could be worth something. Just the, okay, so we're gonna set that down. That'll be display stuff for the shelving. Okay, please, please, please have a Blastoise, a Charizard, or a Venusaur. I might have to open all these celebrations packs tonight. I, I really want that Charizard pull. I really want it. Come on, come on. Okay, we got a Lugia. We got another Lugia. We got two sets of legendary birds, which is pretty dope. We can sell those. We got another Ho-Oh, that's the third Ho-Oh. I don't know how, how many Ho-Ohs I can stand. <laughs> okay, what is that? That looks interesting. Let's see. Uh, Lunala, I'm not too interested in this, but we haven't seen this, this one yet. The Lunala. There we go. In fact, I'll just show it with the, in the light better. Okay. What did we get? What did we get? Okay. That is Zekrom. So Zekrom is another one of those legendary types. Um, pretty cool that he's an electric type. I wouldn't, I would have thought it was a dark type or something. Um, I'm still not, I'm not completely satisfied. I want the old three let's go again let's yeah. see what we can do let's eviscerate these packs here he is what are you doing okay oh i eviscerated <laughs> that pack for sure i just ripped i just ripped the crap out of this pack People everywhere are like, yeah, you should just let her open up all the packs because you suck at this. Okay. That one's not going to be the display art that I wanted, but okay. Can I shuffle it? Yeah. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. What's it going to be? Okay. We got some kind of trainer. Professor's Research. All right, we got one of those. We got one of those. Show me the money. Okay, we got a Rocket Zapdos. This is the second Rocket Zapdos. As much as I like this card. We got another Ho-Oh. That's like the fourth Ho-Oh. Okay. All these Ho-Ohs. Okay, what is that? That looks interesting. Okay, Palkia. Yes, this was Pearl. This was a pro card. So yeah, I guess it's just like this, this 25th anniversary collection is like, to me, it just seems like it's all legendaries. That's amazing, but I will not do it. All right, let's pick up from here. I wish they just did one more card, you know? Four cards is just not, it's not enough.
Okay. We've got all of our packs here now. Oh, oh, I, I already saw something. I already saw something. I shouldn't have seen. Shouldn't have seen it. But it makes me confident that there is something here. No, it was not the Blastoise, the Venusaur, or the Charizard. But it was different. Callie, come here. Come here, you wanna see what we're, we're opening up? There you go. Okay, so, it's a newer Pokemon. So, Cosmog. It's yeah, I'm not, I'm, I'm not too interested in Cosmog. It's cute. He's not really my jam. Okay, we got that legendary again. Where is it? Dialga. Cool art. And then boom, Kyogre. That's the one that I saw. I'm pretty hype about this Kyogre. It, it does look really cool. So y'all can see that. Uh, okay. The last one. What is that? It looks special. Zacian. So Zacian V. So Zacian is uh, one of the ones, one of the OG uh, sword and shield uh, legendary types, I think. Put that down. All right, let's go for gold. Let's go for gold. We're going all the way here. Mm. We really are. We might as well open the other packs. It's like... Like, how do you stop? They got you. They got you addicted. How do you stop now? Ah, oh, that didn't open the way I wanted it to. <laughs> it feels like my life in general. Okay, well. Oh, um, man. I thought I didn't know how to open them. Okay, I saw a little something. I swear to gosh, better not be the same. Better not be the same. Um... Better not be the same legendaries again. Oh, I, I might have to open another ETB tomorrow. I don't get those three. I really want those. Okay, but I didn't. at least didn't see these. I didn't see any art in full. Come on, come on. Okay, we've got Cosmolog or Cos, Cosmo. Doesn't do us anybody good. Okay. We've had this this guy before. That's the electric type I saw, Zekrom. Okay. Okay, at least it's a Pikachu that I don't have yet. So, let's see. The Flying Pikachu VMAX. Here you go. Nope, we have a Surfing Pikachu. Oh. Yeah, it's pretty. It's a pretty card. It's a pretty card. Okay. Yes! 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 Okay. Oh, I was too loud. I really hope I didn't just wake up our baby girl Aspen. But wow, babe, what, what a great night. <laughs> we did it. We did it. We pulled the Charizard, 